Hello, I'm Kevin and I'm in Cairo, Egypt. And I'm gonna show you where that is. This is my awesome map of Egypt. And that's the Nile River. And if we zoom in, zoom. There is Cairo. This is a different map. Really? Yes, yes it is. This one is of Cairo itself. This is where I live. Downtown Cairo in an apartment. Most of the students who study abroad live here, on this island called Zamalek. Now, let's take a magic journey over to the most famous open-air market in all of Cairo. Its name is Hanul Khalil. Khan Khalil is kind of a wild ride. You can't stop. You have to keep moving because if you stop, you're going to be inundated with people trying to sell you stuff. There's a lot to see. They sell practically everything there. And of course, you haggle for everything. Whenever Americans haggle, we always get ripped off. We call this the foreigner's tax. It's because all Egyptians believe that all Americans are rich. Which, when you come here, you'll find out is kind of true. I bought this pair of socks for three Egyptian pounds. I paid too much money, but that's the equivalent of only about 60 cents in America. At the American University in Cairo, they had another concert. That concert was pretty good. It was a lot like the last concert, but I attended another musical event, and this one was very different. I went to a Bedouin wedding. That was cool. These are the sorts of experiences that are the reason why I wanted to come to Egypt in the first place. In this next part, imagine that this is you, walking in for the first time, and like me, you don't have a clue as to what's going on. <laughs> Bedouin wedding celebration. I recommend it to all my friends. If you get a chance, you should go. What? No, I don't look out of place. Anyway, let me explain to you what's going on just so you can say you learned something. This isn't actually a wedding, this is the pre-wedding celebration. Here, they drink. They smoke. The groom sits up on the stage and pretty much doesn't do anything. Now there's this guy, who's the singer. He's the main event. People come up and bring him money. And a lot of the time he stays up there asking for money from people. The money isn't for him. It's for the groom and the new bride. In return for giving money at the wedding celebration, the singer says your name a whole bunch. Here, listen to this as he recites everybody's name who's given him money. <laughs> Listen to this part, see if you can make out what he says. And why is he saying that? Oh yes, I donated money to. I went up there and talked to the guy. Mr. Gigi, welcome. 
Yep, pretty cool. I need to work on my Arabic, but all in all, not such a bad week. I hope everyone's doing well back at ERC. I know I'm having a good time here.